Stand up, beggars! I'm going first. I'll draw. I'll discard a card to ride. Petro of Grass Ventesta. Since I wrote, I'll set the energy generator. Turn pass. I'll discard Jack Ritter Foul Heart from my hand to ride Blaze Ember Dragon. Since I'm going second, I'll draw one card. In addition, since I wrote a card, I'll set the energy generator. And since I'm going second, I get to energy charge 3. Jack Ritter Foul Heart skill. Since this card has been discarded from my hand, for the cost of riding for my right deck, I can energy blast 3. Draw one additional card. I'll use Blaze Ember Dragon to attack your back card. I'll guard with a critical trigger. Drive check. No trigger. Turn pass. My turn. I'll draw. At the start of my right base, I'll energy charge 3. I'll discard a card and 2 right. Knight of Great Advance, Essential. Ventesta skill. Since it's by Essential, I can call this card to the Regard Circle. And so touch 1. Since Divine System is discarded for the cost of my right deck, I can energy blast 3 to draw 1 card. Next, I'll call Saragon. Now, Asensio will attack your Vanguard. I'll cut and replace Maiden Rona. Drive check. Critical trigger. All effects to Ventesta. Now, boosted by Saragon, Ventesta attacks the Vanguard. If I have more Regards than you, Saragon gains a spiky power. Very well. Doga. Damage trigger check. No trigger. Second check. No trigger. At the end of the battle, Saragon retires. Then, I may look at the top two cards of my deck. I'll add one of them to my hand. The rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Turn pass. My turn. Stand and drop. And I'll energy charge 3. I'll discard Hologan from my hand to ride Boulder X Dragon. When Blaze Ember Dragon is ridden upon by Boulder X, he calls himself the Regard Circle and I get the Soul Charge Dragon. Hologan skill. When this card is discarded from my hand for the cost of my right deck, by Soul Blasting 1 and putting this card at the bottom of my deck, I can draw 1 additional card. I'll call Impale Horn Dragon. Boosted by Impale Horn, Boulder X Dragon attacks your Vanguard. I'll no guard. Drive check. No trigger. Damage check. Critical trigger. The power burst to Ventesta. Turn pass. My turn. Stand and draw. Energy charge. I'll discard a card to ride. The fated one of miracles, Razel. Essential skill. Since written by Razel. I can choose up to one great two or less card from my drop and call it to a regular circle. I'll call Saragon. Next, I'll call Tear Fall. Now, boosted by Saragon, Ventesta attacks your Vanguard. See the more regards than you, Saragon gains a spiky power. In addition, Ventesta also gains a spooky power if a Razel with three Vanguard. I'll guard with a critical trigger. At the end of the battle, Saragon is retired. However, I look at the top two cards of the deck. I'll add one of them to my hand and the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Now, Rizal attacks your Vanguard. When the Fatal Wild Miracle attacks the Vanguard, I can count blast one, kill out the two cards of my drop zone with different grades, and a total grid less or equal number of cards in my damage zone and call it to the red zone. I'll no guard. Checking Twin Drive. First check. No trigger. Second check. No trigger. Damage trigger check. Draw trigger. I'll give the power to my Vanguard. And I'll draw one card. Tier 4 attacks Lace and Bar Dragon. I'll guard with Jack with the Meat. Now boosted by Saragon, Shivamiya attacks Blaze Ember Dragon. Saragon gains a spiky power. Blaze Ember is retired. At the end of battle, Saragon's skill is retired. And I look at the top two cards of my deck. I'll add one card to my hand, and the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Turn pass. My turn, stand and draw. And I'll energy charge 3. I'll discard Kogolon from my hand to ride the unpainted one of Parallel Arts, Vaga Dragon. Boulder X Dragon skill. If this card is written upon by a grade 3 Vagra, I can call this card the Regard Circle. Kogan skill. Since this card was discarded for the cost of right deck, I'll show glass one and return it back to the bottom of my deck to draw one card. I'll call Drag Return Midheart and Obduracy Blade Dragon. Boosted by Midheart, Boulder X Dragon attacks your Vanguard. Boulder X Dragon skill. When this unit attacks a Vanguard, and if I have a grade 3 or greater Vanguard with Vagra in his lane, this unit gets plus 5k power. I've got a critical trigger. At the end of battle, Boulder X Dragon is retired, and I draw one card. Now I'll use the Fated One of Unparalleled to attack the Fated One of Miracles. Vagra skill. When this unit attacks a Vanguard, by Color Blasting 1, I can retire all of my Vanguard. Then, this unit gains plus 10k power. Of Fury Blade Dragon skill. During my turn, if my partner doesn't have another copy of him, this unit gains plus 10k power and he cannot be retired by card effects. I'll no guard. 
Twin Drive check. First check. Critical trigger. I'll give all effects to Vaga. Second check. No trigger. Damage check. Second check. No triggers. At the end of the battle, since Vaga used his skill, he restands and he gets minus two drives. Since one of my units restood by a card effect, I'll activate Jack Ripper mid heart effect by retiring this rear guard and draw one card. Now use Blade Dragon to attack Razael. I'll guard with Blade Feather Dragon. Boosted by Impale Horn, Vagra attacks your backup once again with no drives. Impale Horn Dragon skill, during the battle that this unit boosts, if I have with Vagra in his name, this unit gains plus 5k power. In addition, if this unit boosts the Vanguard, it gains 2k more power. A perfect guard, I'll discard a card to nullify the attack. Turn pass, my turn, stand and draw. Our energy charge to 6, a Persona Rise. I'll draw one card, and the Pharaoh gives us 10 power. I'll activate the order card, which is at the beginning to clear the wall. So it's still a Pound Blast 1, and I'll draw two cards. I'll play Saladon and Ariel 6. Next, I'll call for Front Knight Tier 4. Since I played order card, I can Soul Blast 1, and look at the top 5 cards from my deck. I'll call Saladon, and the rest shuffled back into my deck. Next, I'll call Gigantic Masher. Boost up a Saragon. Masher attacks your backguard. Saragon skill begins 5k power and a brand new skill. I'll guard with Stealthy Amogera and Burning Fail Dragon. At the end of the battle, Saragon skill is retired and I'll look at the top 2 cards in my deck. I'll add one of them to my hand, the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Now boost up Aerial Sage. Razzle attacks the backguard. Aerial Sage skill, during the battle that this unit boosts, if my Vanguard has a great tree of Raider Razel, Aerial Sage gets a 5k power. In addition, when this unit boosts a Razel Vanguard, I'll discard a card from my hand, in order to contract one and gain plus 2k power. Razel skill, I'll count last one, and for my drop zone, I'll call a total grade of 3. I'll call Saragon and Biscotti. Biscotti skill, Chase is played onto the Regard Circle, and I personal wrote this turn, I can energy blast 3, and look at the top 3 cards of my deck. One of them goes to the top of my deck, and the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Very well, I'll no guard. Checking the twin drive, first check. Heal trigger. I'll heal 1 power of damage, and the power goes to Biscotti. Second check, no trigger. Damage trigger check, over trigger. When this guy is checked, it is removed from the game, my Vanguard gains 100 million power. Draw one card. In that case, Biscotti attacks your rigor. Saragon skill begins with spiky power. Obviously, Blame Dragon is retired. At the end of the battle, Saragon is retired and I look at the top two cards of my deck. One goes to my hand and the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Boosted by Saragon, tier 4 attacks your Vanguard. The attack doesn't hit but Saragon retires and I look at the top two cards of my deck. One card goes to my hand and the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Turn pass. My turn, stand and draw. Our energy charge 3 and our persona right Vaga Dragon with persona right I'll draw 1 card and my front row gains plus 10 power I'll call a drag meter Shira and over the X Dragon I'll use Shira to attack your Vanguard Shira's skill when this unit attacks I'll energy blast 2 and give the new skill to Boulder X Dragon Shira gains plus 5k power Tier 4 intercepts Biscotti intercepts and I'll guard with another Biscotti this Scotty skill, when it's placed from my hand to the Guardian Circle, I can pay 3 energy to draw 1 card. Boulder X Dragon will attack your Vanguard. Boulder X Dragon skill, when this unit attacks, it gains plus 5k power. I'll guard the critical trigger. At the end of battle that Boulder X attack, he is retired, and I get to draw 1 card. Its new skill from Shura allows me to add it back to my hand when he's retired. Boosted by Impale Horn, Vagra Dragon attacks your Vanguard. Vagra skill, when this unit attacks, I'll count on last one and retire all of our front row rear guards and give them plus 10k power. When Shira becomes retired by the beauty of Vaga, if you have a great three of Vader Vanguard, I can count on last one and call her back to my rear guard circle. With both of the Tail Horn Dragon skill, he gains another 7k power. Our perfect guard! I'll discard Novia to nullify the attack. Twin drive check, no trigger. Second check, critical trigger. I'll give all effects to Shura. At the end of the battle, Vagra restands. In Tail Horn skill, at the end of the battle, that this unit boosted the Vanguard with Vagra in his name. I can Soul Blast 1 and retire this unit in order to draw one card. Once again, I'll use Vagra to attack your Vanguard. 
I'm got with the bigger rich stage. Since the attacking unit attacked two or more times, this unit gets an additional 15 pace shield. Once again, I'll use Shura to attack your Bandla. I'll use Shura's skill once again. When this unit attacks, I'll energy blast two and again plus five more power. I'm no god. First check, draw a trigger. I'll draw one card and the power goes to my Bandla. Second check, no trigger. Turn pass. My turn. Stand and draw. Energy charge to three. I'll personalize. I'll draw one card and the Pharaoh gives us 10k power. I'll call Divine Sister Biscotti. Biscotti skill, I'll energy blast 3 to look at the top 3 cards of my deck. Since it's not the battle phase, to among them I can call one card. I'll call Novia. The rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Next, since Novia is placed on the Regard Circle, if I have a great 3 Vanguard with Brazil in its name, I can count blast 1 and look at the top 3 cards of my deck. To among them I'll call Saragon. The rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Now I'll activate the Fated Wild Miracle's Divine Skill. By Soul Blasting 1, I place all critical triggers from my drop zone back into my deck and shuffle it. Razel then gains one drive for this turn and I'll gain a new skill until the end of the fight. Boosted by Saragon, Biscotti attacks your banger. Saragon's skill, he gains spiky power and a new skill. I'll intercept with Shura and I'll use Big Jewelry's Garlic skill. By returning two cards back to my right deck, it gains plus 15k shield. At the end of the battle, Saragon is retired and I'll look at the top two cards of my deck. I'll add one of them to my hand and the rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Boosted by Aero Sage, the Fatal Wild Miracle attacks your Vanguard! Aero Sage's skill, he gets a spiky power. I'll activate Razael's skill. By Count Blasting 1, I'll call a total of Great Fall from my drop zone. I'll call Saragon and Gigantic Masher. Gigantic Masher's skill, when this is placed on the Regal Circle by ability of Razael, he gains a spiking K power. Oh no god! Checking the triple drive. First check. Critical trigger. The critical goes to my Vanguard and the power goes to the Gigantic Masher. Second check. Third check. Over trigger. The over trigger goes out of play and I'll draw one card. In addition, the 100 million power goes to Novia. And Novia gets to reset after he attacks. Damage trigger check. First check. Don't trigger. Second check. Don't trigger. Now Novia attacks your Vanguard. I'll use Twin Buckler Dragon to perfect up the attack. Thanks to the Over Trigger, Nobia restands. Boosted by Saragon, Nobia attacks the Vanguard once again. I'll use Elementary Sanctitude. By discarding one card from my hand, I'll modify the attack once again. Since Saragon boosted, it is retired. I'll look at the top two cards of my deck. I'll add one of them to my hand. The rest goes to the bottom of my deck. Now, Dragonic Measure attacks your Vanguard. I'll guard with Jack with the Foul Heart. Foul Heart skill. I'll Energy Blast 3 to draw 1 card. In addition, I'll guard with 2 Critical Trigger and Drag with the Shura. Turn Pass. My turn, Stand and Draw. Energy Charge 3. Once again, I'll Persona Ride. Faded 1 of Unparalleled, Bagra Dragus. From my hand, I'll call Drag with the Foul Heart. Foul Heart skill, when placed on the Vega Circle, if I Persona Ride this turn, I'll Energy Blast 3. I can choose one great one for my drop zone without Sentinel and call it the back row rear guard circle. I'll call Red Jewel Beast Garlet. Red Jewel Beast Garlet skill. When this card is placed on my rear guard circle, I can return two cards that were originally for my right deck and draw one card. I'll place both Baga and Boulder X Dragon back to my right deck and draw one additional card. From my hand, I'll call Impale Horn Dragon. And I'll call Boulder X Dragon. And I'll call Burning Flail Dragon. Boosted by Burning Flail, Drag Ritter Felhart attacks your Vanguard. Nobia intercepts, I'll guard with Pro B. At the end of battle, that Burning Flail attack, I'll place him into the soul, and for this turn, right. Boulder X gains an additional 2k power. Boosted by Garnet, Boulder X Dragon attacks your Vanguard. When Boulder X attacks, he gains plus 5k power. I'll guard with Discordy. Discordy's skill, since he's placed in the Guardian Circle, I'll count Blast 1, draw 1 card. I'll add on a critical trigger and cut the wall out. At the end of battle, that Boulder X attack. He is retired. I'll draw one card. Now I'll use Bagra to attack your Fangar. Bagra's skill. By Count Blasting 1, I'll retire all of our front row rear guards. And Bagra gains an additional 10k power. I'll no guard. Twin drive check. First check. No trigger. Second check. Critical trigger. I'll give all effects to Bagra. Damage check. First check. Critical trigger. The power goes to my Vanguard. Second check. Critical trigger. However, that's not the end. 
The fated one of Miracle's divine skill. The wings of Miracle Descent, they shall heal every wound. I feel one power of damage. And Mavenga gains us 10k power. At the end of the battle, Vagra re-stands. Boosted by Impale Horn Dragon, Vagra once again attacks your Vanguard. Thanks to both of Impale Horn Dragon's skill, it gains plus 7k power. I'll guard the attack with Invigorating Sage. Since Vagra attacked twice, it gives an additional 15k shield. And I'll add on a tier 4 to guard the attack. Impale Horn Dragon skill. At the end of the battle, I'll Soul Blast 1 and draw 1 card. And this unit is retired. That's not the end. Fatal 1 of Unparalleled Divine skill. At the end of the battle that this unit attack and you have 4 more damage in your damage zone, I can Counter Blast 1 and reset this unit and this unit gains back 2 drives. What? I'll use Vagra to attack Razael once again. I'll guard with Blade and a Dragon. Twin Drive check. First check. No trigger. Second check. Drop trigger. I'll give all effects to my Vanguard and I'll draw one card. This allows Vagra to break through your shield. Damage check. First check. No trigger. 